A standard data structure in computer science is the associate of array, which is also called a map. In Python, this structure is called dictionary. Dictionaries are used when you have key value pairs of data and input which is mapped with output. These are two linked values where the key is a unique identifier where we can find our data and the value is that data. Dictionary is a very useful data type when dealing with the data which has key value pairs. In this video I am gonna show you how to use dictionaries in Python. You can think of a dictionary in Python as a sort of like a lookup table. Just as an example, let's say you have this table of information. This table indicates that Krish is 35 years old, Rajat is 32 years old and Monty is 28 years old or in general there is a value of 35 with the key Krish the string and the value that's associated with the key Rajat the string is 32. These are sometimes called key value pairs because we have a bunch of keys and a value associated with each of the keys and you can use a dictionary to store this kind of information. Let's see how we can do that in Python code. To create a new dictionary you can write the following d equals curly brackets. I'm going to run this cell. This defines a new dictionary that's empty. It doesn't have any keys or values and it assigns that dictionary to the new variable d. Another way to write the same thing is to write d equals dict parenthesis and it would do exactly the same thing. Here this dict is a python reserve word. You can see here it also created an empty dictionary. Let's go with the curly brackets for now and actually you could also write this so that it has some predefined keys and values as well. Let's go for the first one for now to define an empty dictionary. After defining an empty dictionary, you can add a key value pair like d square brackets double quotes Krish equals 35. This is add a new key value pair where the key is Krish and the value is 35. We will see the output by printing the value of d. Let's run the code. We can see the key value pair Krish with the value 35 is added to the dictionary D. We can add more pairs by writing for example D equals square bracket double quotes Rajat equals 34 and D square brackets double quotes Monty equals 28 and now this dictionary has three key value pairs and to find the values that associate with a certain key for example Krish you can just write print D square bracket Krish when I run this code this will print the value that's associated with the key Krish that is 35 and now of course if you want to print out the values that associated with the key Rajat you can just write print D square bracket Rajat and it will print out 34 and if you try to look up a key that doesn't exist yet it's gonna give error for example, if you do D square bracket ln, let's print this value, it gives us this key error because the key ln doesn't exist. As we saw, the key that's associated with Monty 
was 28 but it is possible to change the value that's associated with a certain key after we already have that key value pair in the dictionary we can do that just like before d square bracket monty equals 22 and once we run this cell now the value associated with monty is 22 one thing to note here is that the value can be any type but the keys can only be certain types and there are different types we can use for that but most commonly keys are strings or numbers and in python you can even mix different types of keys let's check the value of d let's run this to print the value associated with the key monty you can see the value has changed to 22 from the previous value 28.